just the queen. Is she still uh, as vibrant as ever? Yes, but since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised. They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been prowling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I feel that she might be planning something terrible. I've brought th this matter to everybody's attention, but nobody has taken me seriously. They think I'm distraught over a losing father. I understand why you are so eager, and I am happy that you came from me to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person other than mo person mother will listen to. When I heard that Libram's theater ship was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here, no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tatlan, Tantalas, to kidnap you. And so the plot thickens. I once promised your father that I, should anything happen, I would protect you. We've known about the disturbances at Alexandra for some time, but had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help. He and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Libram be was behind it. We were forced to take action because we knew Alexandria would never seek our help. I'm relieved we were able to get you here. At the village of Dali, we saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems, controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they were being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're related to Vivi, but if Mother is planning to use them for war, we won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black mages, she wouldn't make our move as long as we have our airship fleet. Don't worry, everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now, now, come on, don't be so formal. I'm helping you because I'm your Uncle Sid, not because I am the Regent of Libra. Thank you so much. Heart and soul of Liberum, our airship dock. This is dock number one, where we conduct our research. But where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a new airship model in here about six months ago. It was our latest creation. It did not require mist to fly. The man who, atta the man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no. Actually, I met a lovely lady at the pub. Um, when Hilda found out about my little affair, she used her magic and turned me into a new block. Then she stormed off with a new airship, which I named Hildra Gyande. Pretty ironic, eh? She hasn't been back since. I've been working on Hildra Gyande too. But it hasn't been going too well. My mind just hasn't been the same as an Uplug. I am hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you, but with Southgate badly damaged, I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. Don't worry, Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure my mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Uncle, is something wrong? Huh? No, I was just thinking about the, how the steer ship crashed. Baku sure what has good men working under him. Uh, man, I don't know how long I'll be able to keep this up with my throat. Good morning. You're up early. Liberum is a really busy place. I've never been... I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go if they want to be alone. 
Libram has always been this, like this. People come here and from all over the world. Some of them come here to become airship engineers, sculptures, actors. Wow. I don't even remember why I came here my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with my Tantalus brothers. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideout is in the theater district. I'm gonna go there right now. You wanna come along? Uh, that's okay. I'm gonna go look around town. Okay, and I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay. I can go by myself. Oh, okay. You go find this, yourself a cute girl, okay? Oh boy, synthesis. Uh, synthesis, synthesis, synthesis. Hey bro, what are you gonna teach me today? Lots of neat stuff. Today I'm gonna talk about the synthesis sound. Don't need it. Because it's just a shop where you uh, need two items and some money and you turn it into a better item. And there's a safe point in here. Let's see what time we're at. Uh, i got a few minutes left. I think I'll try to go get to the synth shop and then I'll end the video. There is, however, some money right there. Yep, uh, that's a pretty good spot to get some money. There's also some other stuff to find, uh, small town, right? In a big city. What a huge town! I'm completely lost. Pardon me. Jeez, you're dressed awfully funny. I am Captain Albert Frosty of Alexandria, and I humbly request your assistance to get back to the castle. Ha ha ha, that's a new one. Nice try, but I don't date bums. Um, you should really scrape that rust off. It's disgusting. What? Huh? Do you always strike out that badly? I think you need a new line. A little shine wouldn't hurt either. What are these things? They're called gas pickles. They're one of Lebrum's delicacies. Do you want to try one? It smells really terrible. The worse they smell, the better they taste. I guess I'll give it one a try. Uh, oh my, even the locals don't eat them in one bite. Whew. But you're right, they're good. I got a few minutes left. I have to hurry this up. I'm gonna go as fast as I can. Just trying to get to the synth shop because uh, I want to synth a whole bunch of shit off screen. Should be right down here. Five too strong. How many times do I have to tell you? A few degrees can make the difference between a good weapon and a bad one. Use a lower flame. Stop nagging. We've got a customer. When is he gonna get it through his head? So this is the synth shot. These are some of the weapons that you can make. We can't make them all because we don't have any of the items, but we can make uh, cotton robes with the wrist and steeple hat, ogre with two mage mashers, and a butterfly sword with a mage masher and a dagger, and desert boots with leather shirt and leather hat. Uh, I'm going to make, or try to make all of these, I'll even go to the uh, store and buy some of these items. I'm pretty sure you can buy them here, other than like wrist and stuff. So, I'll see you guys next time for the next episode of Final Fantasy IX. See you guys then.